And this is Tia Fimo Lopez, Spawn the Great, Guillermo Rigandau. One thing I like about um Lopez game is he like he like to get a read on what you're doing and then that's when he go to work setting his traps up for for your for your um your setting your traps up for your offense and he'll set a little trap. He take little keys how you like to throw how you like to throw the right. If you like to throw that right, believe me, he's going to set a trap for that. Left hook, you like the left hook, he's going to set a trap for that. So his, he's well schooled, and his father taught him a very good style of boxing because it's not all about banging. He liked to set up rounds beforehand, what he's going to do. He liked to set up rounds before he's going to do but Rigandell, what Rigandell doing right now is Rigandell is not showing him no, he's not showing him anything. So he making, making um, Tefimo keep setting his feet. So he really can't sit down on nothing. So if you, if your feet is constantly moving, how can you sit down on your punches? And when you do, when you do get a chance to throw a punch when he's in front of you, it's you'll never know what punch he's going to throw because because you, because he don't he don't, he's not standing there coming in behind one two one two jab. His style is way more complicated than that. See when he come in, Lopez is not really ready. He can't he can't set his traps and that's Devin that's um Lo, I mean that's um Lopez Lopez claim the fame. That's why Devin Haney. Will be a counter. He will be like, he will be the best opponent. He'd be the best opponent for for him. If if um Lope, if Lopez and his pops don't take that Devin Haney fight, they are fools. Their fight will be on pay per view, and I could see him getting a devastating knockout because of the holes that Devin got in his game. Y'all oh, check this check this film out. Lopez spawned against the great um, Guillermo Rigandell. If you the boxing enthusiast and you like boxing, this is the video to watch. It's got very entertaining. Very entertaining fight. I like the setups. I like the I like the lateral movement. That does a lot for you in the late rounds. Having good lateral movement to start the fight off with. That means you're not going to be walking into a whole lot of traps because a person don't know what shots that you're going to let loose. He constantly, by the time he, by the time he starts sitting down on shit, he's not going to have enough information to counter you and shit. And that's what you want to do. You want to keep him guessing.